No, no, I have. The Honourable Member for Courtney Alberni. Mr. Speaker, on the eve of the National Day for Truth and Reconciliation this year, I was honoured to join a celebration in New Chalna Territory of the art created by attendees of the former Alberni Indian Residential School in the late 50s and 60s. This artwork was inspired by volunteer artist Robert Aller, who encouraged the young artists to paint their ideas, their knowledge and their truths. After Robert passed away in 2008, 36 paintings were donated to the University of Victoria and then repatriated to the survivors who created them into their families in 2013. With the assistance of Professor Andrea Walsh in partnership with one of the artists, Wally Samuel from Ahousit. Since then, they have been widely exhibited to educate Canadians and the world about the legacy of residential schools. They have reached thousands of learners through gallery exhibitions, digital platforms and public presentations. Canadians owe these artists and their families an enormous debt of gratitude for the generosity of spirit, sharing those, these wonderful paintings as we seek to reconcile historical wrongs with Indigenous people. Clicquot, clicquot to all.